No, I don't believe in apologizing too late unless a person that you committed wrong to is already dead. Hey, but then again, the channel 14.com for the Dragon Knights. I'm Joe. My name is AG, and I'm talking about people who are dead. <laughs> and also in the room, we have Hannah and Nikki. Yay! Yay. Oh, what are you talking about? Dead people. <laughs> We're talking about you cursing in front of students. Cursing in front of second graders. They weren't second graders. They were seventh graders. And that doesn't make it any better. <laughs> yes, it does. No, it doesn't. Seriously, these kids <laughs> curse worse than I do. These kids were ninth graders. Right? Okay, so just as a little bit of background, I cussed in front of some of Nikki's students earlier. <laughs> she pulled me away by the ear like, Oh, I'm sorry, mom. You know, like, a bit of an exaggeration. But... Yeah, so I, I apologize, and like she start, and so we started talking about it. And Bok here, being a member of an esteemed uh, member of the academe, a high school teacher, no, an elementary school teacher, here, high school, a high school teacher, uh, says, "Well, I cussed in front of students once. I said sorry, and they were second graders, and like, I mean, seventh graders." <laughs> <laughs> What, what, what were we talking about? <laughs> dead. No, dead he said, no, he said that. No, he, he said an apology. So then he said, I don't believe in the. In, in, you he said, be- no, he said, said, you apologize too late. It's too late. And they, no, AJ started singing. And, and then oh, I replied. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, yeah, no, just, <laughs> what the hell are you talking no, about? You said, it's too, <laughs> no, you late, said, right? <laughs> no, you said, it's too late to apologize. And then I said, it I don't. Right. I, and then I said, I don't believe in late apologies. <laughs> and then the guys went dead. <laughs> but then, like, I can exactly, I, I can see why the song is like apt. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> because you're dead. <laughs> Although technically, no, it's not too late to apologize. Because if you believe in an afterlife, they will hear your apology. But they're still dead. <laughs> they still hear your apology. That's good enough for me. Okay, so they're not, um, they can't forgive oh, me. Oh no, no, what was it? Oh, yeah, because like um, once you once you are in the afterlife, you are outside of time as a manner of being. <laughs> so like eternity is um, a manner of being outside of time, and therefore not subject to that forward movement that we see. And this index card, sir, is black. <laughs> I object. <laughs> so um, it was oh, yeah because you said like I'm not gonna apologize to those kids. It was their fault. Oh no, he said it was their fault. Because it was their fault! Because, because, because you were angry. Yeah, you, okay. you started cussing. You, you cussed yeah, in front of the you, Nikki said you, you shouldn't dropped, do that. You dropped an angry. S-bomb. And then Nikki says, um, you shouldn't do that. They're only second graders. And Box says it was Seven. their fault. <laughs> <laughs> They're second graders? <laughs> Seven! Should be 32 so I can curse in front of you. <laughs> Why aren't you guys 32? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> so yeah, if um, if Nikki's students, if you guys hear about, or if you guys hear this, I'm really sorry. Um, I know it's gonna be, and I know it's cool with you. Like, oh yeah, he's cool, he's cussing, but like you know, not um, in front of your teachers. Yeah, because I cussed in front of your teachers, and like I got into trouble. <laughs> <laughs> so don't you even try that. <laughs> Cause in front of them, you're in deeper trouble. <laughs> I'm usually different. I mean, with regard to this, I'm usually different when no, no. I'm usually different when I'm in school, but when I'm outside, I become a bit more lax with the students. Although, yeah, I still, I still watch my life. So you're like the Batman of teachers. <laughs> no, I mean two face. Yeah, the two face of teachers, man. No, two, two face of teachers. No, yeah, <laughs> I think so. <laughs> no, two Saturdays right ago. Like, Two you, have, you have a side that's normal. <laughs> so this like, is very compelling, like audio. We have a side. <laughs> yeah, oh, wait, exactly. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, we can do that. We can do that. We can do that. We can pull that off. Bro, it's by Nora. Oh. Uh. Hey. Hey. <laughs> hey. No, you should listen to that. Yeah, because like it's it's it's, it's by Nora. What was it? What was it? <laughs> Harvey Dent. Uh, Two Face. What? What? what, what? <laughs> no, no. Oh wait, no, because Harvey Dent is Two Face. So one side should be like normal voice and the other side is like <laughs> the other side is like <laughs> ah, normal voice. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Did he talk like gaga <laughs> gaga? He didn't talk like gaga <laughs> gaga. Why are you picking that only, voice? They only he only talked like that in the animated series. Yeah. Yeah, because his lip and the not- throat was busted. <laughs> no, that's how he talked in the movie, animated the series. But in the movie, the lip and throat, spoiler alert, his just teeth were showing. Oh my goodness, spoiler alert, that movie was released 
どうさんしゃねえとかしてるプリック Pretty r u n d o Yeah. I guess they did. <laughs> And so I played! <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> what, what, to be fair, I only saw it once. <laughs> to be fair, I only saw it once. Only saw it once. This is, this is the type of film criticism that you're going to be getting in our upcoming movie podcast. <laughs> where we have a guy that's seen every movie that I've seen twice. <laughs> And he finds it a disappointment when he's seen it like once. <laughs> Unfortunately, I've only seen Rear Window once. <laughs> Billy b e a n Oh, God. Very Scully. Very Scully. <clears throat> what about Grace Scully? Yeah, what about Grace Scully? Oh, she was so pretty in that movie. In Secret Window? Rear Window. Rear Window. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Rear window. <laughs> so I have a different movie in my head. <laughs> Secret Window. <laughs> no, Secret Window. I mean, Secret Window is that. Johnny Depp, though, right? Yeah, Johnny Was Depp and John Turturro. Yeah. Where Johnny Depp is John Turturro. <laughs> Spoiler alert, I'm sorry. We <laughs> 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 consider it free. <laughs> That movie was a disappointment. Yeah, because Johnny Depp is John Turturro. No, no, I mean... That whole twist in the end, it felt like they made it out of... They made it out of nowhere or something. I don't know. The what, what? No, that, that secret window film? I, I would n t know, I haven't seen it twice. Oh, crap. <laughs> no, I only saw it once. I didn't watch that movie twice. I only saw it once. Well, actually, I haven't seen it. He only saw it once, unfortunately. I think I saw it a bunch of times in AXN. Huh? <laughs> AXN? <laughs> hey, is that me still alive? Is, is that channel still around? I have no idea. Uh, is, is AXN still alive? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> no, because, like, I, I don't watch any TV at all. Like yeah. all, of, all of my entertainment consumption is the internet yeah, and, and law school <laughs> and listening to episodes of Bodega Nights <laughs> because I miss you guys when I'm in Cebu <laughs> <laughs> but all the Bodega Nights recordings <laughs> has been you guys <laughs> I listen to the backlog <laughs> no, no, the back <laughs> because we're old <laughs> we can't even have time to meet <laughs> meet ain't got time to meet <laughs> what was that um What was it? We, we, were, we were chatting on Facebook. Like, so that means、uh, we can have dinner on Saturday night and go home really early because we're old. <laughs> we are, after all, atheists. Shout out to the episode from two weeks ago. <laughs> 19 atheists. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> get it? Get it?、Uh, and this is Nikki, no? Yeah, yeah, she's the first person I saw.、Um, my, <laughs> my, my, my seatmate who asked me if I was an atheist. Oh, yeah. And I was yeah, like, yeah. yeah, I was born in 1986.、So. <laughs> Like, ah, 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 ah. But really, did, did he still ask? Yeah, it's like, and then I said, like, no, I'm not. But, you know, like, I, I thought that joking, it, was a, it was an extremely arbitrary question. Exactly the type of hard hitting questions you'd expect from a lawyer. <laughs> <laughs> Where were you? <laughs> What was it? There was that video of an actual, like, transcript. Mm hmm. In an American trial c o u r t Yeah, like proceeding, asking about photocopiers or something. <laughs> like it, it went really viral on YouTube. I, I haven't watched it, but I, I, I guess that thing really wouldn't happen in the Philippine jurisdiction because we only get like 2,000 lawyers a year. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. What about,、yeah. what about photocopiers? I, I, I can't remember, like.、Um, I can't remember. But they、like. were discussing the finer points of photocopy. Yeah, like, what is this? <laughs> this photocopy didn't come from this machine, but it's my client. They were, they were trying to, like, define what a photocopier was. <laughs> what? <laughs> Something like that, yeah. No, I mean, I'm not gonna be surprised.、Uh, German courts right now are discussing whether a photograph should belong to the creator or the subject of the photograph. Was this because of a monkey that took a picture? No. That was an American court? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, they deemed、okay. that the photograph belongs to whoever created the image. Yeah, so, like, because what was it?、Um, like, so, so, 
Well, the, the monkey that took a selfie, right? Yeah. So, like, who, who, who owns the photo? Is it the owner of the camera, or is it the monkey that took the photo? Or the photographer who made everything possible for the monkey to have a selfie. Or the zoo. Or the zoo. Or America. Thanks, Obama! <laughs> Right, so the U.S. court ruled that it was owned by the monkey, right? Yes. So apparently monkeys can have property rights. And that was the dangerous ju- uh, jurisprudence that it set. Yeah, because now monkeys can own... Property. Stuff. What? Yeah, they can, they can own intellectual property. Oh, yeah, they can own intellectual property. What? Because of, they can own images. Yeah. <laughs> Did the monkey own the print? Huh? Like, what, like if it was printed out, would the monkey have some ownership oh, over yeah. the print? That's what happened. That's what... um. I, I forgot which agency. Where yeah, were yeah, you Western. Yeah. when the Western civilization yeah, well, fell? Um, Something about... Uh, what's it? Take and dump. I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 <That's both. laughs> where was I then? What, 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 wait. Seriously, oh, wait, when was this made? Uh, robot overlords. And you were when was this made? When was this... Uh, when was two this? years ago? When was I? Only two years ago. Dude, a photo of a dust. Got oh. six million in, in an auction and a bidding. Wait, 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 a picture of a, of a what? Dust. But like dust? Peter Lick's photo called Phantom. You can look it up. It's uh, six million dollars for like a. It's just the, the canyon. Yeah, the canyons are very nice. Yeah, yeah, like like. But they're like Adams, dust. But... Yeah. Oh, okay. Because yeah. they look like a phantom or a ghost. Okay. It's titled Phantom. Get it? So, no, I know it. <laughs> and it cost six million dollars. Nobody gives a. Two craps. Now, now I'm being PG because of educators. <laughs> like it's called it as well. <laughs> I don't give two craps who Peter Lick was or is, wow. but he's just really good marketing. I am an educator and you had no qualms about cursing a while ago. Yeah, because it's you. <laughs> because you cussed in front of second graders. <laughs> so it's not your fault for not being 32. <laughs> Seven. Seven. Yeah, uh, it's interesting. And that was really interesting. Like, we have many weird laws, like, for here in the country. To do a drone operator, you have to have a pilot's license. <laughs> and we have hurting religious feelings, <laughs> which, is, which carries with it a criminal liability. <laughs> so, prison time. Like, whoa. <laughs> okay. Like, you should be civilly liable for that, but, like, criminally, I don't think so. Yeah, but uh, then again, courts are passive, so... Yeah, like he, yeah, passive. Yeah. I don't know if ev- anyone has ever complained. He's offending my religious feelings. Yeah, they, outside they, of Facebook, <laughs> it happened once. It happened oh, okay. once in like the seventy or so years that, that that it's been on the books, and that was when Carlos Eldran was. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. His, um, the, the Damaso for the Damaso thing. thing, like dick move, yes. But is it like dickish enough to warrant criminal liability? Uh, the courts ruled in right? favor of. Right? Like yes, the the, the um, it's it's one of those, like one of the things that every law student has to like drill into their heads is, is dura lex sed lex. Like the law is hard, but that's the law, or the law may be harsh, but that's the law. Mm-hmm. So like no matter what the law is, no matter how unfair you feel the law is, the court still has to rule uh, based on the law. And if Congress wants to change it, then Congress changes it. And it applies if it's criminal and it's favorable to the accused. It applies retroactively. Oh. but at the at the <clears throat> time of conviction, uh, the court has no choice but to convict if um, all of the elements of whatever crime uh, it is are present. The tests, yeah, yeah. So there, law one hundred one. There'll be law one hundred one. And uh, peace, <laughs> oh, world peace, yeah. <laughs> And uh, yeah. Yeah. but I think they ruled in favor. Did they have a ruling already, or yeah, cases the, the, are going? The, the, the trial court convicted him. The court of appeals upheld the trial court's mm-hmm. conviction, and now it's uh, going to be appealed to the Supreme Court. Weird. Does he go to jail? Uh, Not yet. It, what's it? Um, when you <laughs> when you appeal, it stays the execution of the judgment. So if you appeal, there's a restraining order on. The execution of the judgment. All right. I'm not sure with criminal cases though. Like criminal procedure might be different. That's civil procedure. I well, I, have, I saw him two weeks ago. Okay, so from an exhibit opening, so he's probably. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because like, what's it? Um, the. Since it's still an appeal process. Yeah, like 
I know with civil procedure, it also depends on like the type of case that it is. Mm-hmm. If it's like regular, if it's an, an ordinary civil action, it's um, the the appeal is stayed, uh, the the execution is stayed. If it's from the labor courts or whatever. Like, yeah. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> Got nothing, huh? Why are you looking at Bok? Because because I'm, I'm waiting for Bok to say something that way we can pick on him again. Eggs. <laughs> Eggs. <laughs> Eggs. Oh, dude. Uh, what 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 of my uh, what of my classmates was asking about Holy Week? Mm-hmm. Uh, he, the atheist or no? <laughs> no, 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 no? Okay. <laughs> no, he was born in '92. Wow. So he's an atheist. No, like, no, so he's a Gnostic. <laughs> <laughs> no, in peace. No, no, yeah. no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was trying to force it in. Or was it ninety one? Anyway, but like, yeah, he wasn't born in the eighties. Just asking about Holy Week, like, what, what, what is, what is the Easter egg all about? <clears throat> no idea about the eggs. Yeah. So what, what, another one of my classmates is like talking about how um, the egg is a sign of. Like new life. Jesus supper. rising from. Oh yeah, <laughs> wasn't the no? Was wasn't isn't Easter really supposed to be the start of spring or something? Yeah, yeah, spring? yeah, yeah. Isn't that what the Easter bunny ah, is supposed to be? Yeah, it's, it's the start of spring because that's, that's and how a rebirth, Easter, spring rebirth, and Christ yeah, 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 coming yeah, back yeah. to that. Yeah, eggs. Yeah, I don't know. No, because because a lot of a lot of early Christian traditions were, were co-opted from the pagan pagan traditions. Yes. What about the bunny? Because bunnies come out in spring? <laughs> because it's easier to sell merchandise? <laughs> I, I, I don't know, because bunnies reproduce like hell. They do? Language book! Appar- <laughs> I kid you not. I had that at a retreat, and apparently some of them... So, and no, there is this podcast got really Catholic. <laughs> no, this guy, no, this guy, you know, one of the... Jesus! Top, one of those that gave us talks so actually told us that they used to breed bunnies, and they literally have to... Separate the female rabbits from the male rabbits because they because murder each other, right? They do. If they apparently these guys, yeah, reproductive drive is so intense, you have to separate them; otherwise, like, they die. Mm. From oh, hyper- so it's like oversex. Yes. Thing. Yeah. Wow. Apparently, that's why that's why they said that. Yeah, you don't multiply, right? Like rabbits, and literally, when you multiply like rabbits, there's risk for you of dying. <laughs> rabbits were based off. Uh, Grinder was based off rabbits. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but so, so, like, so yeah, mm. Last Supper happens right. on Thursday, the Monday of Thursday, mm-hmm. yeah. um, which is it's really interesting because it was a Passover meal. Yeah, that was like, ooh, here's here's bread and here's wine, which is like you know, yeah. starting the seven days of Passover. Anyway, um, most uh, epic drinking session. Right? Yeah. yeah, the most epic drinking session in history <laughs> <laughs> because we drank blood. Dude, Jesus is so metal. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Otto kind of. Well, he didn't eat himself though. He he let other. But he offered himself. Yeah, he, uh, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> and so one of my classmates was like, uh, "No, it happened on Wednesday. The last supper happened on the Wednesday." I was like, "So what? He didn't eat on Thursday." Didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Catholic joke. <laughs> exactly. Putting on the Catholic joke stops right now. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I don't even remember what I was talking about anymore. Oh, yeah, Easter, Easter eggs. Easter. Because Easter. Walt talked about eggs. Another interesting thing about Easter eggs is before the before Easter and after Fat Tuesday, there's the fast mm-hmm. where you're supposed to give something up. Something that people tended to give up was chocolate. Okay. Right. Yeah. And uh, like the 20th century, like associ- uh, had an association for some reason with like b- between chocolate and eggs because of chocolate eggs. Mm-hmm. Sort of like the those, those those chocolate eggs with little toys in them mm. and stuff. So that's another <laughs> reason. Surprise. Yeah, yeah. So that's like an, uh, another reason Why that eggs? that the eggs became a thing on Easter yeah. because of um, breaking your fast, breaking your chocolate fast with an egg shaped piece of chocolate. Yeah. During breakfast. Because you break it fast. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Origins. Yeah, it was sort Breakfast of like, storage, sorry. There was, there was that thing that I told Mark. Um, the word pantalon. Mm. Like, where did it come from? <laughs> pantalon is... <laughs> yeah, it, it, pantaloons? Came, yeah, it came from pantaloons. But I was like, no, dude, it's, it's because like you jump in them. It's for jumping. And <laughs> well, if was you're like, wearing a dress. 
right? Wow, wow. Thank you for Filipino audience to understand. <laughs> if we're jumping in box, like really? I was like, no. <laughs> For non-Filipino or non-Tagalog audiences, Pantalon, pan, uh, talon means jump, jump in English. And when, when you add the su- prefix pan, pan means four. four. Or it means bread. Yeah. So it's a jumping bread. What? <laughs> 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 okay. We're telling the bread to jump. <laughs> All right, we have alienated the and then Greg rolled over to some text, denim textile, and there you have it, Levi's <laughs> choice of construction workers since um, the 1920s. What pieces of bread? Yeah, because Great Depression, they had to throw bread. Yes. Okay. Boom. <laughs> Confidence. <laughs> to sound smart, you just have to sound confident. He nearly got me there. I almost really for that thing. Fridge of pain. Really? No. <laughs> Pantaloons. Pantaloon. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow, really? You're laughing hard now. When I blatantly explained it earlier. But now I have to pronounce it in Tagalog so that you'd understand. Oh, Pantaloon. Pantaloon. It's not a game. I am bread. <laughs> oh yeah, the cool game. <laughs> oh, but they actually literally have to make bread jump. Yeah. <laughs> cool though, challenging. Yeah. Not a big fan, but not a big fan of those types of games though. Like the the, the hyper realistic um, to the point that it's funny? No, uh, not hyper realistic. Like I am bread? Games like that, you Go are Simulator. Bread. Quirky. You are bread. No, um, quirky yeah. games. Like, quir- like the- games that are I don't know, I just don't enjoy games that are like specifically catering to a YouTube audience. Oh, you know what's interesting? Mm-hmm. We recorded like 40 minutes, 50 minutes earlier, and we've been recording for 20 minutes now, and this is the oh. first time we're talking about video games. Huh. Hmm. Are you supposed to talk about video games? Not really. No, no, no. <laughs> it's, it's, third it's, like, it's, it's a thing. It's, it's a thing, though. Like, well, when I, um, it pops up every so often. Whenever I talk, whenever I have a third word, no, whenever I have Bodega Nights with the guys in Cebu, <laughs> we always like end up talking about gaming at one point. Like, <laughs> And um, I guess like this is the third the, world giving us. And we're, when we're with the rest of the guys here, right? We we had um, sports. But there, there was that one episode mm-hmm. where we talked about GTA. video games storytelling and video game storytelling. <laughs> and uh, GTA. No video games. Yeah. And then storytelling. And then video games. And then video game storytelling. And after it's sports. No. No, it, the, the, the sports is episode. The oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. He was there. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yes, I was. <laughs> okay. I, was I love this guy. <laughs> Good lord. Hey, it's a vacation. It's the time I can unwind. Yeah. And ten months of those curse kids. your heart out because when you show yourself to the grade two students. <laughs> seven! <laughs> curse your heart out, Bob. Curse out. <laughs> The title of this podcast is going to be cussing at second graders. <laughs> <laughs> and why you're going to get killed for it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, speaking of games, Bloodborne. Have you seen the Otsuki's latest review? Yeah. This is where I tune up. <laughs> exactly, me too. I was about to. But <laughs> like, I haven't played Bloodborne. I haven't had no, video Blood- game. My only video game, I, the only video game I've played in the past, say, two months. months. Borderlands. Uh, no, Galaxy on Fire HD. <laughs> you have no idea what it's an iOS, uh, not iOS game, it's an Android game. Galaxy? It, no, 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 no. It's weird because it actually had the okay single player. <laughs> it's a like spaceship simulate, not simulator, spaceship control scheme. Yeah, the game we've been playing for the Space, whatever. Maybe we should play Space Team. Right now? I mean, like, not now. <laughs> we should play Space Team as a group. Yeah. Because it's, it's, it's been so long. Like everybody in everybody in school just got serious all of a sudden. They were like, "Oh yeah, we're gonna start studying now," and like <laughs> we didn't play space team anymore. <laughs> so I, I had to study. <laughs> <laughs> I had no choice. I had no choice but, but to read. study and curse at my professors. <laughs> 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 Screw you, Benny. 
<laughs> no, mostly it works. Mostly magic after checking all the papers and so it's usually magic afternoons after school magic. What have I been doing for the past few months? Oh, working my ass off. Yeah, we're old. <laughs> no. Yeah. Yeah, you'll be probably the last holdout. What me? Yeah, we're seventy-seven. You're gonna say no. <laughs> seventy-seven after like a long and like story career. Yeah, like three in the of legal our friends profession. are. Yeah, three of our friends are already dead. <laughs> No, 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 I was just born in 86. <laughs> you know, my pancreatic cancer already. I'm like, oh, last one, no, we're not old. We're dying. <laughs> oh my gosh. We're not old, we're dying. <laughs> That's it. That's it, man. You're not recognizing your age, you're recognizing your mortality. <laughs> Again, trying to sound smart with confidence. <laughs> Gravitas with your delivery. That's how the Sphinx usually wins this argument. But isn't the Sphinx like a piece of stone? <laughs> 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 how to defeat the Sphinx? A chisel and a hammer. <laughs> like a communist. <laughs> with a sickle. With a sour and sickle, you know. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, that's how you defeat Americans <laughs> with the Sphinx, <laughs> with the sicker, with the sicker and the hammer. With the what the hell? With the sickle and the hammer. <laughs> Not a chisel. Yeah, because... <laughs> no, a chisel. chisel and a sickle. <laughs> oh, that. Be... <laughs> <laughs> that, that makes great review. <laughs> He was vigorously waving his arms around. A hammer and ch- no, a sickle and a chis- chisel and sickle. He's still fixing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Me, I'm like moved on. We moved on. Already, already like on the highway we, past we, it. We've had our laugh. <laughs> yeah, took the freeway to the right and went ahead on my route. I still decided in which in where to go. Communists, man, they rule. <laughs> okay. Well, they don't. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> the last holdout is like North Korea. <laughs> Well, well, fine, I guess the communists rule there. <laughs> so chi- no, China. So well, fine, yeah, China. Is China is like communist in light. That's Singapore. <laughs> Shots fired. No, I mean, no, I mean for me, it's uh, not communism, but dictatorship light in Singapore. Shots fired. <laughs> That's shots fired. Yeah. That's dictatorship light. Yeah. Anyway, um, uh, let, let's let's be quiet and wait for Bok to say something. <laughs> See if we, we we can glean some. Yeah, as we're turning the podcast into geopolitics once again. Yeah, <laughs> let's not let, let, let's not bring it there. No. Yemen though. Yemen. <laughs> Kenya though. Jeez, that's so depressing. Uh, Ted Cruz. <laughs> Sorry. Terry Cruz. On ways. <laughs> yeah, we're back to chisels. <laughs> 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 Huh. Hulk's not gonna talk the entire time. <laughs> he just won't, because whatever he says, we're just gonna find a way to freaking counter it. Well, it's not that we're gonna. It's not that we're gonna freaking counter blue it. player. You nah. got nothing. <laughs> What's up? What? what, what, what? Imagine the guy's in reference. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. When yeah. I was really at heart, more of a black control player than a blue control. Again, zone out. <laughs> What, what, what? Still find it difficult. <laughs> Still find it... No, no, I can totally see black control. I only s- <laughs> <laughs> the only... <brotherhood. laughs> That's black control. <laughs> I'm okay. You had a green. Gonna publish the story. <laughs> what? Well, we're not even uh, homosexuals earlier. <laughs> so General, we're not even drunk out. yet. <laughs> Please don't say red, Bob. Please don't say red. Because I'm gonna go Custer's Revenge for this one. Exactly. Oh my gosh. And that because the Cambodians are also called the red people, right? I have no idea. I always associate Cambodia with the color green for some reason. Why? Because the no, book that I read in... Oh, I read. Uh, because, <laughs> because when I was in high school, we did a... 
they had to do like a long paper, a, a big mm-hmm. paper as a graduation requirement. And mine was on the Khmer Rouge. Yeah. And uh, the book that I was reading was a book about the, the, the rise and fall of Pol Pot's communism. I thought, like the color purple, but green. <laughs> <laughs> I, well, the, the book itself was green because yeah, that's like what the Khmer Rouge wore, right? They wore green. Khmer Rouge? For someone who's called Rouge, they wear green? <laughs> yeah, they had the. I thought it was like Khmer Rouge because they called themselves the red people. Yeah, they they, they all they, they wore but they green, wear green. <laughs> they they wore green uniforms and had the red scarves. <laughs> ah, okay, okay. Like, like, I, 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 all right, yeah, the all fatigues. Right. Yeah, yeah. So, but then the book itself is green, so I associated it with green. Mm-hmm. But then I guess I should be saying red, <laughs> thinking red when I think I'm Well, I actually think of like a lot of brown because of like those tower things. You mean temples? That's temples, yeah. Power <laughs> <That we're> things. <laughs> because it has like five. You educated man. You <laughs> just got pagodas. Ah, right. Because but like, uh, what what's it? Ziggurats. Let's see. Let's, see. <laughs> Let's look for deeper words to describe temples. <laughs> well, what's it? Because the uh, well, uh, Angkor Wat, mm-hmm. right, has um, it, it's it's got five. Uh, pagodas temple yeah. tower thingies <laughs> it's got five tower yeah. thingies and that's what you go there for you go there to have that picture where you have forced perspective and it looks like you have five towers right next to each <laughs> other behind you when really it's like freaking far away yeah. it's like a square with like one temple or with one tower in the middle yeah freaking so, far away sorry that's why I associated it with those tower things I thought you were associating it with the green yeah because there's a lot of like foliage around it now Ah. It's become overgrown, you know. Like a lot of vines. There's a there's a hole there where like a Chinese dude whispered his secret, yeah, mm-hmm. <laughs> which they filled up with actual cement. Yeah, <laughs> that was iconic, man. It was iconic. Oh well, not really because you know they had to close it down. <laughs> no one's like doing a pilgrimage on it. Like, not that they know. <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean. The- the devil's toast? No, the, in the mood for love hole. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. Well, if you're not a fan of if you're not a fan of film slash cinema slash movies, that's gonna sound really dirty. Yeah, the, exactly. In the mood for love hole. <laughs> but you know, I wasn't thinking of it. You for nine ninety two. Hey man, somebody has to bring it. <laughs> we can't keep things too like educated. Right? Exactly. <laughs> Yeah, but yeah, I, I was not, I was unsuccessful in locating that hole. You <laughs> got nothing, huh? In the mood for a love hole. <laughs> Share the secrets there and put some mud. <laughs> oh gosh, I'm sorry. Fuck. Oh, you should gosh, be. <laughs> you dirty man. <laughs> exactly, I'm talking about the movie. I'm talking about the movie. high school. Oh yes, mate, I did. In front of second graders. <laughs> Seventh. That's gonna be like a running guy now, dude. <laughs> yeah. Second graders. Whenever I mention like, oh yeah, second graders gonna hear Bok in my mind. Seven. <laughs> <laughs> what year are you in law school? Second. Seven. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <goodness. laughs> And on. which Sunday of the bar is this? Second, seven. Don't <laughs> hear that. Second place, seven. <laughs> second place in the magic tournament. Seven. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. And the winner for second place. <laughs> One plus two equals seven. <laughs> Confidence, kids. Confidence. <laughs> Which was the last World War? Second, seven. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is like, oh my gosh, here we go again. Sure, this will be a joke where we won't be beating a piece of meat that used to be a dead horse. But I think we already did. Yeah. Wow. Piece of ground that they used to where, be. Some ground. <laughs> no, a hole. <laughs> a hole where. Right, so uh, for everybody that doesn't understand what on earth we're talking about, um, we had this joke, and it 
and and we ended More up like seven years beating ago. the dead the second. <laughs> <laughs> so so we kind of like, oh yeah we're flocking a dead horse and like on the second seventh year <laughs> <laughs> we're like yeah it's now a, like like the, the remains of a carcass <laughs> and eventually it was like this hole in the ground and, and the whip doesn't work anymore <laughs> we're just like beating air <laughs> Oh that was God. once a hole in the ground, that was once some flecks of meat, that was once carcass, that was once a dead horse. Isn't the carcass and the dead horse the same thing? No, I was thinking decayed. But no, you were mashing it so much, I was just ground meat, dead horse. <laughs> Ouch. Ground dead horse. Ground you could just say ground horse. Ground horse. Unless like it's a grounded horse, because he's been very bad. <laughs> <laughs> Did it win the Kentucky Derby? Because <laughs> he was cussing at second seventh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what what place did he get the Kentucky Derby? <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> this is the point when people just stop listening to the podcast. <laughs> what are they doing? <laughs> they can't stop laughing at, a, at an obviously stupid joke. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I'm sorry. We 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 we've warmed up to the to the audience. We like totally warmed up because earlier, uh, before Nikki got here, we were record we, we recorded a previous episode, which is a lot less hyperactive, <laughs> a lot less f- full of useless fluff. And a bunch of uh, making fun of Bong. <laughs> yeah, a bunch of... Ma- well, actually, we... But, no, that, that's, that's... Yeah, we're still keeping that going. You know, we're gonna keep that going and going. <laughs> yeah, so, like, every time Bong, uh ends up on this show, um, <laughs> yeah. we are going to be bringing up the... No, we're not, actually. No, we won't. We won't. We won't. We're good. Right. People, I guess, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's just these two times seven that we're recording tonight. <laughs> no, that's the... <laughs> All right, so 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 the joke isn't funny anymore. Well, I guess you said number, t- you said number two. Right? Yeah, it's because this is like seven. our second seventh recording tonight. <laughs> oh god! Well, we have to have the hand gesture as well. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, the, like the people are gonna. <laughs> the audio listeners. Yeah, like the people. The this, hand gesture. No, that's like the like the audio people are gonna be hearing that swoosh of the hand again. <laughs> They're not seeing what a gesture was. Why are we doing hand gestures then? It's your fault. Why? (laughs) What the hell? What the hell are you on about? It's my fault. No, it's your fault. (laughs) What really? (laughs) In the same way that he blames second graders for (laughs) for not being (laughs) thirty-two. Thirty-seven. In a row? <laughs> We're layering jokes now. Oh my god. We're layering inside jokes. Oh man. Yeah. No. <laughs> I, I, want, I want to hear the logic behind this. Like, how is it her fault? <laughs> yeah, Bob. <laughs> All of a sudden, the whole thing about the cursing thing and stuff. So it's his fault. <laughs> <Because> <laughs> Just you were the one I saw that was very heated or something. So it's not worth no, it. It's your fault because I saw co-educator and I just needed to relieve my... Like, I'm angry at my boyfriend. Well, it's the fault of the children for <laughs> giving us the near occasion to cuss. I want to say something, but off the record, how about you? Oh my god. You know whose fault it is? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah, 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 we got that. Yeah, we got that. We got that. We got that. We got that. Yeah. Good thing we're not educators, huh? You know. Mm. Talk to a bunch of people on the internet about stuff, but you know, they ask for help. I don't consider myself an educator. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. You, you are. Know. Yeah. But you can always tell it's someone's make up a shit. Okay, they're they're having <laughs> they're having like. A moment there. So while they're having their moment, you can say whatever you want and nobody's gonna listen. <laughs> I said, unless you say one. seven. 
<laughs> there go again with the head gestures. The what? There go again with the head gestures. The look at him. Oh my gosh. What time is it? <laughs> Don't say it too. <laughs> it's 10.44. Oh, there was a... Oh, no. <laughs> no. Oh, wow. You know what they say down. that like, when, when the conversation runs out, it's always quarter to something. Yeah, yeah. There was... Now it's quarter to 10. 11. Ah, uh, sorry. 2. <laughs> I mean, 7. Um, there was... <coughs> 18. <laughs> Yeah, I, I, I remember. Anyway, I remember. I remember hearing that somewhere, though, or reading that somewhere, that like fifteen minutes before. Before. Bef- yeah, like before when a conversation hour, dies, yeah. it's fifteen minutes Uh-oh. to the hour. How how come? What was the origin? No, that I thing. do not know. I just heard it recently. I think I read it on a stuff. Uh, I read it on a stuff you should know article, maybe. Uh, or one of them. Henry Rollins shows go for hours. ten things you didn't know about America, <laughs> <laughs> which is a good. Yeah, it's a good show. You know <coughs> the, the awkward silences in a group conversation. Usually in the forty-five minute mark. Yeah, like. Well, not necessarily a forty-five minute. Uh, mark. Usually, but, but, yeah, the forty-five. It usually happens there. in the forty-five minute mark. Well, what if you started talking at uh, like two <laughs> thirty? Seven thirty. <laughs> yes. 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 Hey, oh gosh, I, I signed her the my way, man. That was bad. That was bad. I can't believe I fell for that. Oh my gosh, I feel so ashamed of myself. It, it's at the fifteen-minute mark from the beginning of the conversation, unless. Yeah. Was it? What were we talking about? Not because it's, you said oh, the forty-five minute mark. What? Yeah, forty-five minute mark. Fifteen minutes before oh, the before the hour ends or something. Yeah, yeah. No, fifteen minutes to the hour. So if you start at two thirty and at two forty-five, there has to be like an awkward silence. Oh, yeah, fifteen minutes. That fifteen minutes has passed, but it's at two forty-five, seven forty-five, and uh-huh. um, no, you're not. You're, you're not. You're not gonna go for it. No. Okay. <laughs> He's not gonna go for it. Dude, you cussed at second graders. <laughs> Seven. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't me. Yeah, so there. It was you. What do you mean it wasn't me? <laughs> it wasn't you. You cussed at <laughs> you, you cussed at the second grade. Seven! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what was your thought if if you start the conversation at two thirty? You started at two thirty. Seven. Thirty. Uh and then you and, and at fifteen minutes to three. That is 15 minutes into the conversation, or 2.45. So, what do you mean by the 45-minute mark? Are you, like, 45 minutes, 2.45, 45? Or 45 yeah. minutes, 45 minutes in after clock, you begin the, the conversation? Yeah, I think we're clock. talking yeah. absolute time, or... Wait, no, what, what, what? I think about Relative the, time or absolute time? I think I'm about the... Like, I have no idea what I'm talking about. <laughs> I think I'm talking about the... Confidence, man. Confidence, man. No, 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 Oh wait, were we talking about the whole plot thing? Really? Like, like, this is, like, if it's, this is, it's always a bad binaural podcast. Uh, right? Yeah. You can have, yeah. And the audience can remove one headphone, <laughs> listen to a different conversation. <laughs> <laughs> this headphone has a different conversation. <laughs> <laughs> so really, Nobody, you when you... Walk isn't listening anymore. Exactly. Ah. This is what we were saying about like, you can say anything you want and nobody is going to I know, I <laughs> listen to it. No, I tried it a while ago, man. I can but hear it from both sides. Well, yeah, of course you can hear it from both sides because like, unless, you know, they're lavalier mics, but they're not. Yeah, because like this mic can, you know, exceed 180 degrees. Yeah, okay. and sounds are bouncing off this room. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Binaural. Uh, bi- play. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> this is this is a binaural. <laughs> hepta- sorry. <laughs> Good God, what a stretch. <laughs> like, we've been stretching for the past 20 minutes, but now that's the last drop for me. <laughs> Stop, enough. Enough. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but on the hept- Jesus, man. <laughs> Have you no shame? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Well, I have to wake up at 6 tomorrow, so I think I'm going. <laughs> Why? Take a seat. Take a seat right there. Just there. Take a seat right there. Over there. 
What? Take a seat right there. Sit over there. What? Right there. <laughs> I have no idea what he's saying. To catch a predator. <laughs> Never get the reference. Uh, South Park.